Hey guys, welcome to The Whites. I'm Val if you're new here. And we've had a couple of new subscribers this uh, past month, so I wanted to introduce myself a little bit. My name is Val, like I said, and my husband is Pat. He is a firefighter for over 20 years. We have four children, and they're all boys, and they range in age from 21 all the way down to two. Um, here on our channel, we talk about pretty much our everyday life, which usually entails some homeschooling, um, some foster and adoptive, world type of stuff, uh, what it's like to be married to a firefighter, and just you know the everyday ins and outs of living in the northeast part of the United States. Today I have some happy mail that I got in the mail when we got back from a trip we just recently went on, just a one little overnighter, and I want to share with you. Okay guys, the first thing I want to share with you is super sweet and special, I'm wearing it. If you follow us on Instagram, then you would have seen this already. I posted it in my stories when I first, first got it. So before we headed off to our trip, we went to Great Wolf Lodge and we just did a one night over, um, one overnight. So it was like um, midday um, from one day till the close of the park on the next day. So when you rent a room there, you get the whole full next day. So anyway, before we left, we checked the mail and this was in the mail. So this is my awesome new sweatshirt from Sunflower Directive. And so the owner of Sunflower Directive, many of you guys know, her name is Tony. She has a YouTube channel called Chaotic Country and Chaotic Cleaning. So she has two channels that I will link below. And I will also link her info for Sunflower Directive because she is doing custom made, um, sweatshirts, regular shirts, tumblers, um, and I think she's getting into pens, like um, the acrylic pens. And I think she's done keychains. There's a bunch of different things. Tony is so creative and she will totally work with you with you know whatever you want for your project. So for me, I wanted a sweatshirt and you guys know around here, we always say love God. And then on the back here, which I can't, I can't reach, but I'll show you after. It says love people and um, it says Mark, I don't know if you can see that, maybe, Mark 12. And so that's like our slogan around here is to remind each other to love God first and then that will equip us to love others. And so I don't have anything pink, so I decided to go with pink and I was... Um, it was right around Valentine's Day when I was ordering this, so I had pink on the brain, and you know, love kind of all went together. So I got this awesome sweatshirt, and it's so soft and so comfortable. And so I'm wearing a small, just for size reference, but like I said, Tony will totally work with you with whatever it is you wanna order. So go ahead and check her out um, when you're done watching today's right. video. The next two things um, were in our mailbox when we arrived back from our trip. And so the first thing um, I talked about before, let me grab the box for you. It is from Warby Parker. And so this is an online eyeglass company and I'm not sponsored at all. <laughs> uh, but I wanted to follow up with you guys about this because I mentioned how my prescription had changed. I had a prescription I got a couple of years ago very, very mild prescription. I don't know the right terminology for that, but um, it was very, very slight adjustment that I needed. And then this time when I went back, my eyes did get worse and I need both um, distance and nearsighted lenses. And so they have a new thing called progressive lenses. And so thanks to everybody who commented um, on my last video when I was talking about getting glasses, about where you buy them and what type you wear and all that's really helpful. Basically, it's a bifocal lens, so it's for both distance and nearsighted. I guess instead of it being like a harsh line, where bifocals are like there's like a harsh line, there's no harsh line there, so it's easier for your eyes to adjust for when you're looking far or near. That's basically how it was explained to me. So I guess it's a kind of a new thing. So some of you had said you had never heard of it before. So what I decided to do was look online for um, just online retailers of glasses because as you guys probably know, when you go through your eye doctor, they're super expensive. I mean, probably anywhere from like 200 
to 700, 1000, depending on like if you're buying designer frames or whatever. So what I did was I ordered from Warby Parker because they do um, at home try-ons. They have a really cool app. You go on their website and you can use their face recognition app and it takes a picture both of your left, the center, and the right of your face. And that way you can virtually try on glasses, which is awesome. Um, Zenny, the other company that I am going to be probably ordering from, also has the same technology. But what I liked about Warby Parker was that you can pick five frames. They send them to you for free, so you can actually try them on at home as well, and then you just send this back. So that's what I wanted to quickly show you guys today. My box from Warby Parker came in really fast. It only took about three days from the time I did the virtual try on and selected my five pairs of glasses for them to send me. So it came in this nice little sturdy box and inside the box it gives some basic instructions and then it gives you a little um, Warby Parker classifieds and it kind of looks like a newspaper. And basically it gives you your how to's of how to go through your box, place your order, send everything back. And then it has a couple of fun things on here too, like a crossword puzzle and gives you an idea of the other products that they sell. And then it comes with your return address, which I didn't realize <laughs> had my address on it. So you get a sticker here to stick on your box for you to send back. And then you've got your selection of glasses. So what I thought I would do is try on my five choices and I've already made a decision because, well, I had one that I liked and then I wore them for my family and they chose a pair different. But then after thinking about it, I think they're right. So anyway, it'd be fun to see what you guys think I picked. So I'm gonna try them on. Okay, so the first pair of glasses, are these and I'll give you a hint I did not pick these <laughs> the only reason is because they're really really loose they're way too big on me um, I will note that on the website you can order pretty much every pair of glasses with um, in either narrow medium or wide uh, there might even be like extra slim or something too um, so this is the first pair but I did not choose them because they are really loose on me and um, I think this is, I think they send you them in medium, like the medium width to begin with. So when I put these on and I saw how loose they were compared to the other glasses, I decided that probably wasn't a good fit for me. So I did not choose those. I'll give you, give you that heads up. Okay, here's pair number two. So comment down below and we'll go, you know, one, two, three, four, or five. Which one do you think I chose? Here's Number five, I've got a lot of glare. That's something I have to get used to with glasses. Now I'm seeing <laughs> all the glare when you're filming. I don't have a ring light on or anything. I just have my dining room light on and it's still causing a glare. So that's pair number two. Pair number three. And surprisingly, all of these, these are a little cat, cat eye a little bit. They come up a little. Like I said in my last video, glasses, I'm not a, my face doesn't look good in glasses, so this is really tough because I don't look good in glasses to begin with, but like I said, my eyes need to see. Okay, pair number four. <laughs> and I think most of these also came in different, like clear or darker colors, but I just went with, um, either lighter or darker shades, I mean lighter or like tortoise shell, because the dark frames like black really don't look good. And here's the last pair, this is number five. So they're all kind of similar, right? I think glasses in general, unless you go really outside the box, which I'm not comfortable with yet, because I'm new to glasses, um, you know, they all kind of look the same. All right, so those are the five ones I picked to try on at home and they are all plastic. They're like an acetate. They don't have like the nose piece. I went without those because um, 
usually a lot of, I, well, I used to always buy aviator sunglasses that had the little nose piece and they would always get stuck in my hair and just not comfortable. So I went with the all plastic and they're all really lightweight, which is nice. And like I said, they come with, um, you can get them in progressives, bifocals, a standard prescription. And they also, I think all have scratch resistance and glare resistance. And then you can uh, add on, uh, like blue lock, blue block, blue light blocking. Sorry, that was a tongue twister. Blue light blocking um, coating as well. And there's other options you can add on to it. Um, or you can just go with the standard package deal. So I'm going to place an order for one of these. And then what I'm also going to do, because I discovered a huge price difference. So this is the main part of what I wanted to share with you guys. If you're like me and you don't have like a really strong prescription and you don't even need to wear glasses all the time and you don't want to spend a lot of money by going to your eye doctor, going online is a really good option. The tools that you use to figure out what you like are really easy to use. And, but even within online retailers, um, there's a huge price difference. So Warby Parker for the glasses that I want to order because they're progressive lenses are still $295. Now, if I had a single prescription, it would be $95. So I guess doing the progressive lenses does add quite a bit. But I then went on Zenni Optical and did the same process. The only thing is they don't do the at-home try-ons. At least I couldn't find the option to do that. And I thought I had read online somewhere that they did do that. So I don't know what I'm missing. But regardless, I knew that my Warby Parker glasses were coming and I could try some things on in person. So what I did was I took the pair that I really liked and I went on the Zenni Optical website and looked for a similar pair. So the similar pair with progressive lenses was um, well, $35 for just the frames. And then I think with the progressive lenses, it was less than 100. It was like... 60 or 90. Once I look it back up, I'll I'll put it here um, on the screen for you guys so you can see the price difference. So even within online retailers, there's still a huge price gap. I don't know why that is other than I'm guessing quality. So what I'm going to do is order both um, because like I said, the Zenni ones are so inexpensive that I could get multiple pairs, which is probably a good idea to have more than one pair. And once I get them both in, I'm going to update you guys on what the differences are. Are there quality differences? Is there a vision difference? Are the lenses actually different? So I'm curious to see that. And so I thought it might be helpful for you guys. So that's the update on the glasses. And I have one more piece of Happy Meal to share with you guys. Okay. So normally, just for my, anybody who's new around here, I don't usually do unboxings all the time. I'm not usually a big shopper. So this is a rare thing you're going to see on my channel, but since they all came in at the same time, I figured why not make one video out of some good stuff that came to me. Um, okay, so the next thing that I want to share with you guys has to do with this hair. Okay, no shame. You can see I'm going to be 45 in about a month, and so it's um, a privilege of getting older that you get white hair, you get gray hair, you get a little silver, a little crown on your head, but... Um, I'm still gonna dye it. So I have an appointment tomorrow actually to get my hair dyed and trimmed because, you know, split ends. Um, but the other thing that I struggle with is thinning hair. Now this is a problem mostly on my dad's side of the family, um, both the men and women. Um, I'd say half and half of, of the lineage <laughs> deals with uh, thinning hair. So I have been dealing with that ever since the birth of my first son, which was 20 years ago, 21 years ago and it's just gotten worse over time. And so my hair is very thin. Um, I joke because when I was young, my hair was so thick you couldn't even put an elastic band around it, and now look at it. It's very, very thin and fine, and um, I lose a lot of it all the time, and I try not to wash it as infrequently as I can. Right now, my hair is very limp because um, when we got back from Great Wolf Lodge, I just washed it and then put a ton of conditioner in it to help repair it from all the chem, um, chlorine that was in the pools. So, you know, anyway, I'm making this very long. The point is my hair is in bad shape. <laughs> I've been looking for some non-toxic, good products for my hair, and I'm very skeptical about shampoos because I've used a lot of them in the past, and honestly, they haven't done anything, and I've given them a long, 
haul. So I have another one that was recommended to me and I wanted to share it with you guys today. And then maybe I can give you an update in a month and then six months and so on if I continue to use it. So let me show you what I got. So here it is. This is the new product that I'm going to be trying. It's called Virtue. It says Real Science, True Beauty. And of course, and everything these days comes in beautiful boxes. But here it is. This is their Virtue Flourish Hair Rejuvenation Treatment. And it's 100% drug free. And it doesn't have any of the big no-nos that I was looking for in a personal care product. In this box, there are three products and there is a shampoo. I'm gonna turn it around here. Maybe I can show you guys a little bit closer. A shampoo, a conditioner, and then a density booster. This is a one month supply. Now, I don't know what they mean by one month because I wash my hair probably twice a week. And that's again to preserve my hair a little bit. So on the box here, it says, a new approach to hair thinning. Born from regenerative medicine, the two groundbreaking keratin proteins that power our Flourish products are like nothing the world has seen before. So it's got alpha keratin and gamma keratin. You know, it's got some statistics on here about how many women saw results. I'm not sure if that's focusing for you guys. But, you know, of course, it's not going to work perfectly within 30 days. Um, most of the results are after like 60 days or even longer. So I'm excited to give this a try and see what I think. Um, so I will report back to you guys when I've been using it for a while. So like I said, this is not a typical video, an unboxing, but in case some of you are watching and you're looking for new eyeglasses, maybe you've got some hair issues <laughs> and you're looking for products like I was, then maybe this would be helpful for you. So. I'm going to have to give you an update on all of these things once they come in. So thanks for watching, guys. And don't forget, go check out Tony at Chaotic Country, Chaotic Cleaning, and her new shop, uh, Sunflower Directive. And order something for yourself or a loved one, and you will be very pleased because she does a great job. So until my next one, I'll see you guys later. And love God and love others. See you later.